if you've already watched my TED Ed video on sunscreen, then you know that chemical sunscreens can actually kill coral reefs. And I'm here in Thailand, and I thought it would be a great opportunity to try out some new mineral sunscreens I have not tried before, as well as talk about the ones that I am totally in love with. So before coming to Thailand, it was super important that I find ocean safe or reef safe products to put on my skin because I knew that I would be spending a ton of time in the ocean. My impressions of these two are, this one is gonna be the clear winner, the Burnout. Um, it's still really thick and I try to put some lotion in it and mix it in my hand and then put it on. Um, it, it wasn't my favorite ever, but if I'm gonna be in the ocean and I need a good ocean safe sunscreen, then I would still totally go with this. But this was kind of a loser for me, unfortunately, and I usually love badger stuff, but this one went on way too thick. It was super chalky, it got everywhere, so I definitely would not buy this one again. I'm gonna use both of them up because I'm already here and that would be wasteful just to throw them away, but out of these two, I would say this one is my favorite. So this is my first time really utilizing sticks. The two sticks that I brought with me is Baby Organics Pure Mineral Sunscreen and Badger Broad Spectrum SPF 35. And they're great because you get to like have a lot of mobility with them. You get to stick them in a backpack or a purse or your pocket and they're solid so that makes it TSA compliant which is awesome. Um, Baby Organics, this one is gonna be titanium dioxide and zinc oxide which is pretty cool because it's combining those two really good mineral ingredients for sunscreen. And the Badger one is going to be just zinc oxide. Out of these two, I wanna say that the Baby Organics was actually my favorite. I think it went on a little bit smoother and it was easier to rub in. Um, again, this is gonna be spot for like the top of your nose, under your cheeks, kind of like on the cheekbones, uh, like the kind of balls of your shoulder. This is gonna be an easy way to touch those parts up, but it's not gonna substitute having a regular lotion application first thing in the morning or before you go out. So if I'm gonna stay dry, I'm most likely gonna be wearing makeup at some point in the day. And that might not be important to you, but it's important to me, so I'm gonna talk about it. Um, I absolutely love this stuff. This is by Color Science. As you can see, it's like almost gone. And this is an SPF of 50 and total mineral sunscreen. You can put this on by itself or you can put it on over makeup, which is really cool. And even for you guys out there that don't normally wear makeup, I put this on my boyfriends that are like super burn in the sun kind of guys and it's fine. Um, I forgot my favorite that's waterproof and I use it daily, um, sun lotion. I totally just didn't pack it in my bag. So I had to buy something kind of on a whim. Um, I really love La Roche Posay's Amphibios, but I didn't have a chance to use it on this trip. But instead, I got Clarence Paris, and this is something I picked up in the duty free in the airport, and I'm actually pretty pleased with it. Um, it's SPF 40, and it works really well. It goes on really smooth. I like it underneath makeup. Um, this is something that you would only use for your face because it's kind of pricey, but it feels great. The only downside is that it is not water resistant. So if I'm going to get wet, then this is not going to do me any good. So I'll want to get something that is water resistant for at least 40 minutes, and 80 is better. Okay friend, there you have it. That is my review of just the mineral products that I brought here to Thailand, and I'll be making some more videos when I return stateside. But if you have some mineral sunscreen products that you super love, please let me know. Send me an email or put it in the comment section. And if you just can't wait for the next video, then I suggest you check out the hyperlink that I put in the comment section for you. For a long, long list of mineral sunscreens that are good for your body and good for the planet. Sawadika. Dude, it's so hot. My like makeup is melting. I'm like melting right now.